So you guys are always asking me how you can expose yourself to zines if they're not being sold in bookstores in your city or if there's really no zine fest going on around you. If this is you, I want to tell you about this thing called Zenomatic. These people, they find zines from all over the world, they put them in a package, and then they send them to your door every month. Right now it's December and I just got mine in the mail so I wanted to do like an unboxing or an unenveloping to show you guys what it looks like. Big envelope, there's gonna be zines in here. Why do I have eyelashes on? Okay, that filter put eyelashes on me, but there's gonna be zines in here. And <laughs> oh, to closer look at everything, here's a full color zine called Epic Fail Compilation, a zine about failing. Instructional musings for encounters and summoning. Ooh, I'm really excited about this one. It says a handbook for amateur musicians by George Milburn. This looks pretty old. I'm not sure if someone made it to look like this or if this is actually a really old copy of this. Okay, judging by the paper quality, this might be kind of old. 1926, boom. Ooh, and look at the fold on this one. The cut is so interesting. The Pummeling Pyramid by Andrew Goldfarb. Oh, and that is like glued on there. Wow, that's what zines are all about. Look at that. It looks like someone cut out the eye and pasted it on the cover so I could tell that a lot of care went into making this one. The package also came with some extras, like some stickers and this fortune teller, miracle fish. I the last two zines, Korea Angry, issue number 11 featuring Lauren Kim. This is a very, ooh. Sorry, I really like the art on the back, but oh my gosh. Okay, I can't wait to read this. This is so cool. It's like claymation, but in a comic. The last scene that came inside, it's called Big Squishy Heart. Oh, and the art is so cute. If you guys have a hard time finding zines in your city, like a lot of people tell me that. A lot of people leave comments saying like, my bookstore doesn't sell zines or there's no zine fest in my city. If you have a hard time finding them and you don't want to look online and you want the actual physical zines, I would definitely recommend you checking out Xenomatic and subscribing. I will link them in the caption so you can see all of these cool zines. Look at even this old one and there's stickers <laughs> and there's a fortune teller.